So I'm Courtney Doyle Visit from Plymouth Rock Oyster Grower Company, and here is my lovely daughter, Isla, here to show you that oysters don't need to be hard. We have a great shucking video on our website with my brother, Connor Doyle, um, that can make this just a piece of cake. And some of the recipes with that you want to serve with oysters are so easy that even a, uh, Isla, how old are you? Four. A four-year-old can do it. So we're just going to get started with a super simple sauce. Um, it's basically a cup of your typical cocktail sauce. Hey Isla, if I hand this to you, can you please put it in a bowl for me? Mm -hmm. This one? Yep. Yeah. Can you please put that in that bowl? Well done, well done. And then we're just gonna put in three tablespoons of dill pickle relish to put three spoonfuls in. One, two, three. Great job, Isla. Two tablespoons of prepared horseradish. Can I do some? Yep, now don't, don't smell that. I'll make your nose burn. Ish. Okay. I didn't smell it. I know. The juice of half a lemon. Remember we tried? Squeeze. Squeeze. And, oh, Isla, where's the curry spoon? The little curry spoon. <laughs> awesome. And half a teaspoon of curry powder. Oh, well, ish. And now we're going to put half a teaspoon of curry powder. And now, absolutely, now mix. And once it's done, all you really need is a small dollop on each oyster. I just you really, did it. You did a great job. Because you really want the, the sweetness and the saltiness of the oysters to still come through. You're not trying to mask the flavor. You're just trying to complement it. So all, all you really need is a little bit. Well done. That's delicious. And as Julia Child would say, cooking is always better with wine. Yeah. Here you go, Chinese. Oh, thank you. Thank you.